Hey guys, Coach Sue and Coach Alex here with Physique Development, and today we're going to be going over the cross cable tricep extension and why you would step back or step more in line with the cable. So I'm going to have Alex turn around real quick to talk about something within the positioning of the tricep. So there are three heads to your tricep, and they are going to come into line with the kind of ridge of your scapula, such slash your rear delt here, and they're going to be pulling against that. So that's something to think about as you're going through the movement, is it's kind of pulling against. Um, that rear delt positioning here. Another thing with that is with it attaching here on the rear delt and then also attaching on the humerus on the upper arm, it puts people in a position that when they go really narrow with like a rope that's too small for them or a V-bar attachment as they're pressing down, then it puts them in a spot where it's um, wrapping around them and that's not very advantageous. So going in the cross cable tricep extension where you're lining up the upper arm um, with the cables allows you to have it where you're hitting all three heads of the tricep and that's why we prefer to do a cross cable tricep extension or using a longer rope. So Alex is gonna go ahead and grab the cables here and he's gonna start stepped back. And like I said, he's in a position where his upper arm is lined up with the cables. They're all in a line here. Um, and as he goes ahead and goes through this movement and he stepped back, he does have a slight hinge at the hip here and that is a-okay, keeping the spine and neck neutral um, and going through the cross cable tricep extension. With him stepped back and the reasoning why you might see people at the gym stepped further back is that resistance pulling here is gonna put him in a place where he's hitting the fully shortened position. Now, now if he's to step more in line with the cables here, he is putting himself where the cables are pulling more vertically and so he is hitting more of the mid-range position so he can go through a few reps of that there. Once he finishes those up, we'll be good to go with you understanding why you would step back or you would step in line. Now, if you are wanting to hit the lengthened position of the tricep, we do have a video going over the cross cable facing away tricep extension, which is going to work the tricep in the more lengthened position. So there you have it.